Good morning, good morning. Welcome back to Coffee in the Word. Grace and peace to you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. I hope and pray that you're all doing well this morning. Well, I want to start off this morning by wishing someone a very happy birthday. Miss Martha Willis, uh, I understand she's 95 years old today. So Martha, happy birthday. I hope you have an awesome day. So with that, let's get started. All right. Uh, this morning, we're going to start off with Psalm 126, and then we're going to Isaiah, and then we have a reading in Philippians. So, Psalm 126, and as always, may God bless the reading of His Word. So, here we go. When the Lord restored the fortunes of Zion, we were like those who dream. Then our mouth was filled with laughter, and our tongue with shouts of joy. Then they said among the nations, The Lord has done great things for them. The Lord has done great things for us. We are glad. Restore our fortunes, O Lord, like streams in the Negev. Those who sow in tears shall reap with shouts of joy. He who goes out weeping, bearing the seed for sowing, shall come home with shouts of joy, bringing his sheaves with him. All right. I get a little more coffee here. I'm I'm having a, uh, some more of that vanilla brulee stuff. It's really good. I like it. All right, the Old Testament lesson this morning. Isaiah chapter 43, verses 1 through 7. So here we go. But now, thus says the Lord, He who created you, O Jacob, he who formed you, O Israel, fear not, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by name. You are mine. When you pass through the waters, I will be with you, and through the rivers they shall not overwhelm you. When you walk through the fire you shall not be burned, and the flame shall not consume you. For I am the Lord your God, the Holy One of Israel, your Savior. I give Egypt as your ransom, Cush and Seba in exchange for you. Because you are precious in my eyes, and honored, and I love you, I give men in return for you, peoples in exchange for your life. Fear not, for I am with you. I will bring your offspring from the east, and from the west I will gather you. I will say to the north, Give up, and to the south, Do not withhold. Bring my sons from afar, and my daughters from the end of the earth. Everyone who was called by my name, whom I created for my glory, whom I formed and made. All right. Uh, next, uh, going to the New Testament. Let me get a little. The New Testament lesson this morning is from the epistle uh, to the Philippians, uh, chapter 2, verses 19 through 24. So here we go. I hope in the Lord Jesus to send Timothy to you soon, so that I too may be cheered by news of you. For I have no one like him who will be genuinely concerned for your welfare. For they all seek their own interest, not those of Jesus Christ. But you know Timothy's proven worth, how as a son with a father he has served with me in the gospel. I hope therefore to send him just as soon as I see how it will go with me. And I trust in the Lord that shortly I myself will come also. And this is the word of the Lord. All right, next we'll go to the Pray Now app and I'll read the prayer of the day. All right, let us pray. O Lord, by your bountiful goodness, release us from the bonds of our sins, which by reason of our weakness we have brought upon ourselves, that we may stand firm until the day of our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. All right. Well, I hope and pray that you all have a fantastic day. And uh, so, and once again, happy birthday, Martha. And uh, so, anyway, y'all have an awesome day. So be safe, be happy, and be blessed. And we'll see you tomorrow on Coffee and the Word. God bless.